got a video for you guys. I'm going to show you guys the programming, okay, for this tool. Um, right now in my TLX. So I'm going to go to special functions, uh, mobilize a reset, okay. And we're going to go to Acura. It's going to communicate with the vehicle. Then I'm going to go by auto search, see if that works. Turn the ignition on, shows me a TLX. It's a smart key. Push the start. If it's 22 or later model, you need to connect this device to a network. Please turn the ignition on. Press the start button twice. The ignition's on. Then we have add key, all smart keys laws, number of red keys, replace BCM, replace ECPM, and function introduction. So what I'm going to do is all keys laws. I'm going to delete all the keys. Take all the smart keys out of the car. So right now the keys are working. Working keys. And I'm going to delete them from the system. And then I'm going to add them both back and show you guys. Right now at this point in time, as you can door locks work from the key. The second key, door locks work, everything work. So I'm going to delete them and show you that it doesn't work anymore. And then uh, program them back in. Okay, so I have to take all keys. So I put in all keys lost, right? So the ignition's off. It'll power the ignition on the computer itself. So I'm going to take these two keys and take them out of the car. Put them outside of the car. So now we're going to go through the process. Oh, it says take one smart key to be learned into the car. So I take this one into the car, leave one in. I'll leave one key in, and the other one stays outside. Press the ignition twice. Can the ignition be turned on? I'm going to put no, like I lost all the keys. It says keep pressing the ignition start button and do not release. So hold it down, like so, and it'll power it on. The computer will power the car on. So it says communicating. Uh, they're asking how many keys I want to program. I'm going to put two keys in. It's configuring the system. Take um, the smart key out of the car to whom it is and put a new smart key in the car. So that's the key light on the dashboard. If you ever see a Honda on Acura and that key light is blinking, that means that the key is not programmed. That means the key is not programmed to the car and the car is not sensing the key. Once that green light go, green key light goes out, that means that the key is programmed to the vehicle and the vehicle will start. If that's blinking, the vehicle will not start. So I'm going to take this key out and put the other key in. So I have the other key here. See? It says keyless access remote not detected. So that means it's not detected the key. Okay. So I'm going to put the new smart key in the car. Communication failure detected. So switch the ignition off. Turn the ignition off. Switch the ignition on. Is the green light out? Yes, the green light is out, meaning that the key went in and it's good to go. Switch the ignition off. Switch the ignition on within 15 seconds. Switch it off. Switch the ignition on. Program success. And the key light is out. Knowing that this key is in the car, the key light's out, and the other key is out there on the grass, so the car doesn't sense it. So I'm going to turn the ignition off, hit the lock and the lock button, and the key works. Let me try the other one. This one works too. Though it's not fully closed, that's why. And we got the lock. Lock, lock. Yeah, both remotes work good. 
and the car starts. The whole process is, that's exactly how you do it when you have all those keys. It's that easy. With this tool. If you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Peace. And it also has replace ECPM. So if you need to replace the computer, you can use this. It'll replace the ECU if you got to swap it. All right, have a good day, y'all. Peace.